Hi everyone, this is now how you put fractions in Microsoft Word. So once again, you need to click insert and then in the symbol, you can find now their equation. Now, it's going to work out, you insert now new equation. So this is now, you need now to type in your equation. So now in this case, you can have now different kinds of setup for fractions. So on different kinds of setup of fractions for a while, so you have this kind of situation in the fraction. So they are have going there. So when you type it here, for example, I want to type in two thirds. So you have now to type two slash three and then space you have now a fraction. So that's good. Now for rational algebraic expression, it's for example, you have that. So I put slash and then space. So you have now x squared and you have now x plus y, x plus y. So that's how you go with the fraction. For a complex structure of fraction, you can work that out in this manner. So I use slash. And then if you want to have a fraction in the numerator, so that's what you call the major numerator. So you put that way. So you have now A over B. Well, here in the denominator, if you want to make another fraction, it's like adding now slash. And then you have now C over D. Another complex structure is that when you have now this one. So let me have now space for you guys. So after that, we have now one plus, and then you have now a fraction. You can now combine that. So you have now, for example, x over one plus over one over x. So those are some common fractions that you might use.